Alright, so, flip camera died. So we are now on MacBook. And now we can show you what we were thinking. So, we have the support. It fits in the top if it's standing. Okay, so that's with the paper towel in it. But it's still kind of upstairs yeah. if you start shaking it. Like, even this way, there's nothing there. Yeah. So it's like, we need something... Maybe we have something more solid, like tongs or something, but like something they can brace in. Yeah. Because then we can't... We have to brace it in, like, on the sides, so yeah. we can't cover up the camera. Well, what if we have, like, a rubber band, like, over top, so hold it in rather than stabili stabilizing it from the yeah, bottom? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. So, but the rubber band would need to go across this way and yeah. not that way. Yeah, but we have these, like, little wing things that we can, like, be possible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we have a rubber band? I don't know. We would have to find one. To be honest, I don't think we're going to find it. Probably not. Um, so that would work. Well, it would work if we had one, so we have to find something else. Yeah. Um, well, what about this person's headphones? Just to tie it over properly. I don't know if this will work as well. Well, what if we just loop it? Here, can you hold it on top? Is it still looped? Maybe if we had a combination of the two, because this really like gave it the friction so it wouldn't yeah, slide. Yeah, yeah. So it's a little better. Now try to find it. It's hard to get it tight, tight enough. The rubber band would have been really helpful. But I mean, see, it's getting it's definitely better right. until it gets loose, and I don't want to tie mm -hmm. it because it's yeah, it it's stuck. Headphones. So, to make it stable, it needs it needs something in like all directions. Mm -hmm. So we have by tying it, we're, we can cut out like one direction. Mm -hmm. The paper towel gives it support this way, and there's no really, there's not, there's no forces acting on it up. So it's just this front and back that we need to figure out. Mm -hmm. But to do that, we need to make sure we don't cover the camera. Then there was something. Um, so what can I mean? It, is the camera on the center of it? No. It's like towards it's the top. Off center. Yeah. So if it was if it was centered, like we could have some kind of supports going here and here, which we can still do, mm -hmm. at least on one side. So it's more like that, right? Yeah, I mean, we can have there's room here for something, but like right here is along the edge. Well, the thing is, the lens is looking at it here. It only takes up this much. Oh yes. So you can cover up. Part of it. So you we can have support on this front. Yeah, so maybe like if you're looking at the whole thing, we have a support here and then maybe a support here because it's actually like more like that. Yeah. Top center. Um what up here? Can I see the back and the locker? So if we want full like usage of it though, we need to make sure we don't cover up the buttons. Mm -hmm. And granted, like because they're buttons, even if there's a support there, like we can generally push. Yeah. Against the button. Like, if this was a support, it yeah. still clicks. Um, because then you also have to cover up the screen. But if you're looking at the screen while it's being, while you're recording it, then, uh, I think that's part of just like practical needs of it and not so much. So, yeah, something like that. Play, trash, and which I guess, if you're already recording it, you don't need access to those because 
it, that's what stuff you'd be doing afterwards once it's once you're done recording. Yeah, but if you want to if you want to go back and look at something, I think the the play might be a good option to help. Which I'm I'm not sure if you can, but because there's still the options the buttons on here, mm -hmm. and so the center is record, and then I don't know what the other ones do while it's on. Well, because if you if we let's say let's say we messed up and we wanted to fix it. Do yeah. you want to go to the camera and not have to untie, untie it, everything. review the tape, and then start again? Yeah. So you still want to use the one on the left. Yeah. So but what, what side is it? You're looking at the front. What side is that on? So front, it's here. Oh, so it's on the short it's side. On the short, it's on the short side. So no matter what, that one is pretty much Well, maybe not. So if we go across. It's not. Could be okay. It could be okay, depending on what it is, what it's being used to hold it. Mm -hmm. So going across there just misses the button on the back. Hmm. What's this? Door stopper. It has a screw on it. Maybe if we maybe we could try using this to go into the bottom. Yeah. So this is the, the thing on the bottom we were talking about, but it doesn't quite fit. It's a little small. Well, what if, what if we'd be able to get this, the notch off the back? Because it's already broken. I think the problem with it being broken is that the whole thing is bent. Mm. So it's not exactly straight. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's not coming off. Hmm. Oh wait, no. Is it a screw? Yeah, so the screw is actually inside, the head is inside of it. Oh, okay. Well, because the only issue I think with this is the portability. The stability. Okay, so. So yeah, the, just the the stability there, but then also the portability of it. Like it's not exactly something you can just like whip together real quickly because you need to have a trophy. <laughs> well, what about this computer monitor? If we like take it to the back, yeah, because then we can even swivel it. Well, because we I wonder how much of it is a fix for just this situation, or if it's something that we can do. Okay, well that's, we that's kind of adding another variable to it. Yeah. So. Location. Yeah. Is it one instance? Or is it portable? Mm -hmm. Cause I'm wondering if if we had like a pencil with an with an eraser that was large enough, because the eraser is gummy. And uh -huh. on the inside that is threaded, if you're able to actually screw it in and have that dig into the threads. Well, can you try it? I, I, we need an eraser that's large enough. Because that one with the mechanical pencil didn't have enough on it. Yeah, so with the mechanical pencil, it's really not going in. Yeah, and all these pencils over here are too small. Well, what if we took the this off? No. No, because the, the erase is only so long. Shit. And this just narrowly misses the size that we need. Yeah, this one's a little bit longer, but not going to be enough. I don't know if we're going to get a, an eraser that's much longer, longer than this. this. Because like even with the mechanical, it barely fit in. Oh, really? Yeah. I dropped the eraser, though. I don't know where it went. See, just like how that lined up, I think if the rest of the eraser was there, we'd be able to screw it in. I'm going to go ask if someone 